Masemara is well known as the seven wonders of the world because of the great migration of the wild beasts every year. So I grew up in Masemara. I used to see elephants every time I opened the door or the window in my house, but things are changing. Nowadays, it's only to see a single elephant in a year or in a month, which is very, very sad to me. We lost actually 122 elephants in 2012. That is in one year. 2012, things changed, and there was a big drought in the Mara. So people started thinking, what are we going to do later? So after people started growing crops, that is when human elephant conflicts begin. The big destruction caused by the elephant, just by the movement without eating, is causing a lot. So what people will do is starting shooting elephants with the poison arrows and spears. Thank you so much, Alibaba, for coming up with the technology. So Jack Ma, in 2017, adopted one African elephant, and he, he called her Hangzhou, which is the name of the city in China. From the collar, which we put to Hangzhou, we can actually monitor her. We know where she is going, and it's not only Hangzhou. Through the collar, we have been able to create the geofences. These are not the real fences, but they're just geofences created on Google Earth to differentiate between a danger area for elephants and safe area. So whenever Hangzhou goes to the farms, which is a danger area, it, the collar sends me a geofence alert message and I send the rangers to go and push her before getting into the farms. So far we have 23 collared elephants and we saw that 72% increase of elephants in the Mara. What about if you collar more than 50 elephants? We might get 100% increase. The next generation also will learn that technology will actually bring a positive impact to the animals in the Mara. Thank you very much for your time. <laughs>